Hello everybody, and welcome to The Supper, a point-and-click game that shows humans at their absolute worst. Let's go ahead and dive right in. That didn't sound great. Alright, a bite-sized game by Octavi Navarro. Alrighty. Miss Appleton, wake up. I'm sorry, Miss Appleton. I know your old bones are tired. Things were so much easier before, weren't they? But there's no time to rest. Look at the time. Customers will be arriving any minute now. And we don't want to keep them waiting with empty bellies, do we? Okay, so let's see. All right, that's that. We'll resume. Looks like, okay, empty pot. Let's go over to it. Okay, and some embers. Clearly, we won't be able to pick those up by our hands. Special sauce. Okay, we'll get some fire tongs. So, I would assume you'd pick up embers with the fire tongs. Tongs with ember. So then... Ah, I see. So you gotta move her out of the way. I mean, I would assume that would have been correct. Um, maybe on the swordfish tail? Nothing. Solid wax. Let's put that in the solid wax. No. Put it in the special sauce. Um, touching the Swedish tail, solid wax, can't touch it. I need to make a candle, it seems. I can't put it in the empty pot either, it won't allow it. So we'll go to the dining room first. All right, so we need to light the candle. I know, it's dark in here. Some light will make the place much more inviting. All right, so there we go. Yeah, that, that's totally how you light a candle. Nailed it. Well done, Miss Appleton. Now we just have to wait for some starving souls to pass by. Uh, cool. You know, I'm looking great with my bloody ass apron, by the way. I'm looking fantastic. No time for a walk now, Miss Appleton. I smell fresh clients coming this way. And that's the voice in my head, I believe. Why don't you go and make sure our special sauce is ready for them? Okay. Wait, hold on, hold on. I want the water jug. You hold your shit. Hold on, is there any other items I need? No, let's go. Alright. Um, special sauce is there. Ah, whatever. Mmm, smells delicious. Do you hear it, Miss Appleton? Horses. Growling stomachs. Here they come. Well, I got friends now. Um, hey man, turn around, man. Do you think it could be them? Well, let's go have us a day. Us and our sweet ass peg legs, by the way. I, I just now noticed I have cool peg legs. Customers, oh my goodness. We are hungry. Look, the chest. They are the men we've been looking for. Let's find them a place to sit quickly. All right, so they're all seeming pretty chill. So they, or so what would the gentleman like to start with? Mind controlling fungus, <gasps> deadly shark, old man. Uh, I can voice pigeon a la sauce rose is our chef's specialty. Okay. And he wants, uh, oh god, do you hear that, Miss Appleton? Oh. Hand and tongue mm -hmm. stew. Mm -hmm. And you thought the recipe wouldn't be appealing to our customers. I was right, you were wrong. <gasps> mm -hmm. Ooh, spicy red swordfish, a personal favorite. A mouth-watering del delicacy that's healthy as well. Ooh. Lots of omega-3. <laughs> So that's a spicy red swordfish for the mind-controlling beast on the left, a pigeon a la sauce rosé for the sick old man on the right, 
And a fine hand and tongue stew for the dangerous looking blue shark in the middle. <gasps> of course, all served with our delicious secret sauce. Come on, Miss Appleton, go and fetch the ingredients. Don't forget to check out the recipe list on the kitchen wall if you have any problem remembering them. Okay. Well, okay. So we got a recipe list right here. I need a wild pigeon, cover with special sauce. One blue swordfish tail, add one chili pepper, cover with special sauce. Hand and tongue stew, one plump human hand, add one slimy tongue, cover with special sauce. Well, I doesn't seem I can take that swordfish tail off right away. Um, there's an empty pot. All right, we outie. I think. All right, y'all do your thing, man. I will be right back, I guess. <gasps> okay, so I need to go outside and uh, there's a pigeon. All right, let's hit the lever then. Let's see if that does anything. Okay, nothing. Jail door. Okay, things are starting to really go off in my head a little bit here, and I'm imagining what I'm going to need to do. But we'll see. Alright, there be a pirate ship here. Fish oh. Poor old Pete. I always knew he'd lose his head sooner or later. Um, wet boot. Thanks. Uh, okay. Uh, seems to be everything it can't. Oh. Oh, it's stuck here. So let's go see what we can do with this wet boot then. Off we go. I hope you're not thinking on climbing up there. Sorry. <laughs> there we go. I got me a pigeon, boys. That's the main ingredient for our pigeon, Suprema La Sauce Rose. Now, let's finish the dish. All right, we got our first one. Let's go. It's a bit silly. All right. Um, blue pigeon into the empty pot, I'd imagine. No. Yeah, just throw it in the special sauce to hell with it. All right, we made our first. Well done, Miss Appleton. The pigeon a la sauce rosé is ready to be served. Here we go. Give it to our bro over here. You are good, sir. Bon appetit, monsieur. Hello? Does it kill him, <gasps> I wonder? The special sauce is murdering. You can tell by his pale face that he really enjoyed his last supper. Don't worry, they are used to pass out in taverns, or they are used to pass out in taverns. They won't notice he stopped breathing. All right, we got some scissors, which now, if I remember correctly, that's gonna take us down here, so we can cut the rope here. Or there. And now the rope comes down and we can climb up. Oh my God, the animations are great. Let's go down through the that was creepy. Well, there's some peppers. The ceiling looks completely parched. We'll need to find it a nice drink. Ah, oh, well, okay. I got the empty water jug so we can fill it in the puddle, I'd imagine. Yeah, that's more than enough water. A yeah, full water jug. That's how this works. No worries. All right, and then all of a sudden, let me guess, instant pepper? Yeah, that's how life works. All right, we got chili pepper now. That's good stuff. I'm not upset. This is great. All right. Then we'll go into the captain's cabin here. Oh. Hmm. I think I know this guy. Let me taste his blood. No. That was creepy. Sip. Wow. Oh, yes, indeed. <laughs> Captain Clint McMurray. My sister's second husband. Looks like you won't be beating anyone up ever again, Clint. Oh, wow. Clint was a piece of shit. Gotcha. Okay. All right. So now we have a knife and we have a chili pepper. Um, I was wanting to try to cut off his hand. 
I think... Oh no, who the hell wanted what? Okay, so you don't want that there. I can't get off the swordfish tail now though. So that is good. All right, so we lost the sword. Um, perfect, those are the main ingredients. Now let's finish the dish. All right, so let's throw it in the special sauce then. Which, well done, Miss Appleton. Our spicy red swordfish is ready to be served. Okay. Which, if I'm correct, I think this guy wanted that. Not, yeah. Bon appetit. <gasps> oh my goodness. That was actually pretty impressive. Aha. Oh yes, a satisfied stomach. The delicatessen is a pleasure worth dying for. Haha. Do you get it, Miss Appleton? It's funny. Come on, laugh. Oh, she actually laughed. That's funny as shit. Oh my goodness. Okay, Jailer's Keys. It's all coming together, boys. All coming together. Because that's a jail door. All right, we're going to go visit somebody in jail. Skeleton hand. Which means... Uh, no, no lever. Okay. And then we'll go back in. We have a skelly hand, which I... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Big brain. Here we go. Hold on. Hear me out. Big brain time. Or not? Huh. No? Oh, I see. Aha, hold on, hear me out. All right, this is the big brain I was thinking. That's how we made the human hand. So we made a wax hand. Wait, wait, wait. A special shot should be added at the end, Miss Appleton. Just follow the recipe. All right. Add one slimy tongue, cover with special sauce. Well, I think I know where I'm getting a tongue. Yep. I guess it's cool. No worries. Don't worry about it. Um, I'm just going to slip by and grab his tongue. No big deal. Perfect. Those are the main ingredients. Now let's finish the dish. Right into the special sauce. You know, I feel so accomplished. Well done, Miss Appleton. The hand and tongue stew is ready to be served. Okay. All right, let's give the... To the deadly shark here. Bon appetit, my cartilaginous friend. friend. <laughs> I have no idea. I probably fucked that all up. No worries. Hello? <gasps> Special sauce does the trick every time. Ah, oh, another satisfied customer. Such a tasty delicacy. Can't help but defeat even the most disconcerting of stomachs. Well done, Miss Appleton. The service was impeccable. I don't think our customers have any complaints, do they? Great. Now let's clean all this mess before the stench gets the attention to the authorities. Uh, well. He's not hungry. He's not hungry either. He is also not hungry. So maybe go to the chest? Be patient, Miss Appleton. Be patient. So, oh, what the f Oh. Great idea, Miss Appleton. This will be useful to carry the bodies out. Dum dee doom. Ten fathoms deep on the road to hell. Yo ho ho in a bottle of- oh, here you are. Jesus! We'd never used a grinder with such large specimens. 
Let's hope their bones don't get stuck. Well done, Miss Appleton. You performed diligently. What? Jesus! So what's in the chest? Thank you, Miss Appleton. I appreciate all you've done for me. At last, I'm allowed to rest, and so are you. I have so many good memories of you and I working side by side. Whoa, that's crazy. You are my dearest friend. When those beasts dragged me out from our kitchen, I knew I was done for. Oh God, and they cut her legs off too? I swear I didn't steal that gold nugget from them. I wanted fair and square. The shark asshole ate my feet. While I was anguishing, suffocating inside this chest they put me in, there was only one thing I knew for certain. You wouldn't rest until you found me, dead or alive. I'm deeply sorry you had to lose your own sanity along the way. Please find a quiet place to bury my bones. Near the old well where I like to spend time. Time for me to leave, Miss Appleton. Sweet dreams, my dear friend. And goodbye. Oh, wow. Jesus. Ugh. Wow, man. If you guys liked the video, please give it a like and consider subscribing. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.